the rock and sock drum throne has arrived let's check it out So I just got my rock and sock drum thrown and so far so good things are going pretty darn well from the images in the video so far you've seen it's a pretty beautiful drum throne uh, so you got your swivel functionality here got a nice little uh, back support here which also swivels got a mechanism over on the right here to lower the chair or higher it uh, on the bottom got a nice little tripod uh, really sturdily and well made that you can adjust and fold up for travel and uh, I will and you also have an adjustment on the back to move um, so you have two adjustments actually you have one on the back pad here so you can move this up and down and you also have one on the bottom here so you can slide the seat and I'll be showing you pictures of all that uh, after this. Here's the back of the throne. Here's the tripod stand. This is the bottom of the chair or throne. Here's the throne folded up and ready for travel. Another picture of the bottom of the chair and the folded throne tripod. Here's the adjustment to move the chair or thrown up or down. Here's the seat cushion and the logo. And finally the back padding. A great side bonus of this drum throne is it also serves as a fantastic guitar chair. You've got your little twist around actions, your support in the back. Also cut away at the legs nicely here so there's no chance of scratching the back of your precious guitar. It's all made of fabric. So yeah, this is a great guitar chair as well so you can multi-purpose with this bad boy. One thing you do want to consider when using this chair is that if you move too quickly to either side or to the back, there's a slight potential of tilting a little bit, so you want to definitely be cautious of that. And furthermore, um, the three legs on the bottom, I have the leg behind me sticking out perpendicular, so it reduces the chance of leaning back and having the chair tilt like that. Thanks very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below.